During what's become a tradition at the society's annual assembly in the United States, young participants joined youth and young adult members of the society around the world on a video conference call. Technology helped bridge thousands of miles and many time zones so these young people could smile, laugh, and share their love for the society. I'm the youth, so I'm the new generation of what's going to become. And I think it's a really great idea for us to get involved with other people from across the country and to share our ideas. This is a one in a lifetime experience and the experience is unmatched by anything I can think of. It's just so great and it makes me feel so good to know that I'm a part of something and that this something is bigger than just me and my local town. The meeting with the youth was amazing and inspirational and it rekindled my passion for St. Vincent de Paul and its mission and it, I thought it was very crucial to the future of the Society of St. Vincent de Paul and just that the youth gets connected so that in the future we can collaborate with them and stuff. A sentiment blessed Frederick Ozenam, who was just 20 years old when he helped found the society in 1833, would appreciate. It was Ozenam who said, quote, I want all young people with both head and heart to assemble for some charitable work. In addition to the Americans on the call, young participants joined in from Brazil, Chile, and even the Philippines.